Rules for Radicals Between Saul Alinsky and Jesus Christ Many self-styled progressives and amateur communists follow 13 principles from Saul Alinsky's last book, Rules for Radicals, a Pragmatic Prima for Realistic Radicals. Pseudo-intellectuals parade as benevolent organizers seeking to unite low-income communities in order to empower them to gain social, political, legal, and economic equality by challenging the current agencies that promote their inequality. Without knowing it, these self-styled saviors of humanity are following the teachings of Jesus applied to the devil's social agenda. Let us review these 13 doctrines in Alinsky's own words compared to Jesus' words. 1. Power is not only what you have, but what the enemy thinks you have. Power is derived from two main sources, money and people. Have-nots must build power from flesh and blood. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you will be my witnesses, to the farthest parts of the earth. 2. Never go outside the expertise of your people. To do so would result in confusion, fear, and retreat. Feeling secure adds to the backbone of anyone. If you know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will the Heavenly Father give the Holy Spirit, to those who ask Him? 3. Whenever possible, go outside the expertise of the enemy. Look for ways to increase his insecurity, anxiety, and uncertainty. Look, I have given you authority to tread on snakes and scorpions, and on the full force of the enemy and nothing will hurt you. 4. Make the enemy live up to its own book of rules. If the rule is that every letter gets a reply, then send 30,000 letters. You can kill them with this because no one can possibly obey all of their own rules. In everything, treat others as you would want them to treat you for this fulfills the law and the prophets. 5. Ridicule is man's most potent weapon. There is no defense. It's irrational. It's infuriating. It also works as a key pressure point to force the enemy into concessions. Woe to you, hypocrites! You keep locking people out of the kingdom of heaven for you neither enter nor permit those trying to enter, to go in. 6. A good tactic is one your own people enjoy. They will keep doing it without urging and come back to do more. They are doing their thing, and will even suggest better ones. Until now you have not asked for anything in my name. Ask and you will receive it, so that your joy may be complete. 7. A tactic that drags on too long becomes a drag. Do not become old news. Therefore every expert in the law brings out of his treasure what is new and old. 8. Keep the pressure on. Never let up. Keep trying new things to keep the opposition off balance. As the opposition masters one approach, hit them from the flank with something new. If David calls him Lord, how can he be his son? No one was able to answer him a word. 9. The threat is usually more terrifying than the thing itself. Imagination and ego can dream up many more consequences than any activist. 
they will fall by the edge of the sword, and be led away as captives among all nations. Jerusalem will be trampled down by the Gentiles. 10. The major premise for tactics is the development of operations that will maintain a constant pressure upon the opposition. It is this unceasing pressure that results in the reactions from the opposition that are essential for the success of the campaign. And you will be hated by everyone, because of my name. But the one who endures to the end, will be saved. 11. If you push a negative hard enough, it will push through and become a positive. Violence from the other side can win the public to your side because the public sympathizes with the underdog. Whenever they persecute you in one place, flee to another. I tell you the truth, you will not finish going through all the towns. 12. The price of a successful attack is a constructive alternative. Never let the enemy score points because you were caught without a solution to the problem. It stands written that repentance, for the forgiveness of sins, would be proclaimed in his name to all nations. 13. Pick the target, freeze it, personalize it, and polarize it. Cut off the support network and isolate the target from sympathy. Go after people and not institutions. People hurt faster than institutions. I tell you the solemn truth, unless a person is born from above, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Lest we forget at least an over-the-shoulder acknowledgement to the very first radical from all our legends, mythology and history, and who is to know where mythology leaves off and history begins, or which is which? The first radical known to man who rebelled against the establishment and did it so effectively that he at least won his own kingdom, Lucifer. You people are from your father the devil, and you want to do what your father desires. Because I am telling you the truth, you do not believe me.